I'm going to talk about anxiety and having Parkinson's. Anxiety is kind of like a, a side symptom that most of us with Parkinson's get. I've never experienced really bad anxiety before I had Parkinson's. So I know it's something that did get worse with my Parkinson's. And I have a lot of anxiety actually around, I was going to say around having Parkinson's, but it's really around the medication that I'm taking. I've noticed that, and this didn't happen the first year. The first year everything was okay, I didn't have much anxiety, but as my Cinemet medication has increased, I've noticed I've had more anxiety surrounding the medication. And to give you an example of what I mean is that I sort of freak out if I forget to take the medication, which I don't really forget that often. But once I do forget, it's like I'm not really sure if I really did forget. Like I'll go over in my mind, like, did I take it? Did I not take it? And I can never really determine if I did or not, even though I count out the pills and I have a little pill box that I put it in. It doesn't seem to matter. Um, I still get anxious about it. I also get anxious about now the on and off periods because um, before they were, well, the first year I didn't have any on and off periods that I noticed. The second year it was more like I would kind of get my um, not a headache, but I'd get kind of like, my mood would go down, and I'd get kind of spacey and out of things. But this year, year three, I'm actually having more traditional, I guess, Parkinson's periods of on and off. And that's where my motor, my motor um, functions or problems show up. So pretty much for the first couple of years, all the problems I have with motor function were hidden. And I have a lot of um, problems with, with motor skills. Um, so now they're kind of sh showing up and it's kind of erratic. So I don't know, you know, necessarily when I'm not going to be able to walk really good. And it just seems like I'm on really. And when I'm on, everything's fine. And then all of a sudden, I'll like slow down and freeze and can't really initiate the movement. So that gives me a lot of anxiety because now I worry like, am I going to be stuck somewhere at this speed and not be able to get home? I don't drive so I um, take public transportation, transportation, but most of the time I walk somewhere. So now I'm like really careful of how far I go and I'm a little bit more anxious about being alone. But of course, I'm alone a lot on these walks or going places since I'm single. So that's some examples of my anxiety and I notice that it's growing the more sentiment I take. So I know they do say that that um, anxiety is due to, well it's just like a side condition and also it could be due to the medication. So those are just some examples of my anxiety that I have. There are other examples that I can give you, but this video will be too long. I just wanted to kind of talk about it, and if you have problems with anxiety, please leave a comment in the uh, comment box so we can um, talk about it and share information. Thank you.